Hi, I'm Mark, and this is The Country Life with Columbus Mark, where I try to give you a lighthearted look at life in the country. And today we're in Durham County, North Carolina, the home of Mystic Farm and Distillery. And we're going to meet one of the owners right now who's going to show us his place. Hi, I'm Jonathan Blitz. I'm one of the owners of Mystic Farm and Distillery. Uh, we're here in our rick house. We have uh, our aging barrels here. Uh, we are North Carolina's finest uh, grain to glass bourbon distillery. We also make a wonderful gin and a vodka, but we're best known for our 45% uh, wheat mash bill bourbons. We grow the grain for that about 20 minutes from here in Hillsboro, North Carolina. We have 108 acres that we lease out there. Uh, and we use the water from the aquifer on our site here. We have a well at 400 feet and we draw all the water directly out of the ground and use it for all of our uh, spirits making purposes. Uh, we hand mash all those grains and we pot distill it in small batches which produces an incredible bourbon. We'd love to have you come out and visit. We started making Mystic Bourbon Liqueur which was our first product in 2013 and that business grew out of uh, basically us taking out a couple of credit cards and a flyer on some bourbon liqueur. And then in 2015, we bought this 22 acre farm property and we started production here in 2016. We're open Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. At uh, Fridays and Saturdays, we're open 10 a.m. to around 7, 8 at night. Uh, we have some wonderful events here on Saturdays. We do tours for the public. We do private tours during the week. And we also have a really unique experience here that almost uh, no one in the country could offer you. And that is making your own barrel of bourbon with us. Uh, that's called the single barrel experience. You start at 9 a.m. It's a private experience. You work directly with me or one of the other distillers here. And you do all the steps in making a barrel of bourbon. At the end of the experience, you're going to fill a barrel. You'll go home with a bottle of the spirit that went in that barrel. Each year, you're going to return and get one pint off of that barrel so you can see how the barrel's aging. And then when it's finally bottled, you get bottle number one of that release, and you have dibs to buy as much of that barrel as you would like to. And it's a really unique experience. It's booked out usually about six months in advance, but you can learn more about it on our website. There's three things about this part of North Carolina that makes our bourbon uh, some of the best in the world. That's not just me saying it. The judges at the San Francisco World Spirits Competition said that our broken oak bourbon set the standard for bourbon in 2021. So we're very proud of our bourbon. This barrel is a really nice exhibit that allows you to see the barrel uh, aging process in action. Here in this part of North Carolina, we have this exceptional water. We have outstanding grain. And we also have the best aging climate in the world for barreled spirits like bourbon whiskey. Uh, when these barrels are filled uh, and the uh, bong is pounded in, the barrel is essentially a pressure vessel. And as the temperature goes up, the pressure inside the barrel will rise and that barrel can go up to two, two and a half pounds of pressure, which doesn't sound like a whole lot, but when you realize there's about a thousand square inches of surface area inside a barrel, that's a ton of pressure pushing that bourbon deep into that new charred oak, soaking out hundreds of flavor and aroma compounds, including caramelized oak sugars that give bourbon its beautiful dark color. Here in the top of this barrel, you see a line and above it is a void. That's the angel's share. This barrel was filled up to the top when it was first filled in May of 2021. Now, uh, roughly almost a year later, we see that we've lost quite a bit of that bourbon to the angels coming and sipping from it. That evaporation is key to the aging process because in this void space, we have a lot of gas exchange. We have oxygen catalyzing chemical reactions that bring out the flavors and aromas of a mature bourbon. And our barrels age for quite a while. People will often ask me how long we age our bourbon. We age it right up until we need a mortgage payment. No, the true answer is that every barrel is going to age differently. Every barrel uh, is made from different trees. Those trees have a century of life and they all had different experiences and barrels can age anywhere from 38 to 60, sometimes a little bit longer than five years. 
So 38 months to 60 months and sometimes even a bit longer. So last question. How'd you all of a sudden decide to go into the bourbon making business? Sir, I plead the fifth to all questions like that, but my wife would tell you that this is a hobby that got way out of hand. I've heard that. Thank you, Jonathan. A pleasure to meet you, and y'all are welcome anytime out of Mystic Farm and Distillery.